Zendesk's Custom QA allows you to define your very own auto QA categories and spotlight insights, giving you more control over what the AI detects and how it scores your customer interactions. Let's take a look. Head to your settings and you will find the new AI section. Here, you will find all of your existing system and text match AI categories and spotlight items. You can edit and customize these, as well as now build your own prompt-based items. Let's take a look by creating a new AI insight. Select prompt-based and give your AI insight a name. Next, input the prompt into the description box. You can use one of our pre-made prompts from the prompt library, or create your own. There is a 2000 character limit, so you can get quite specific with your prompts. We recommend being as objective as possible with your descriptions, and keep each prompt you create focused on one issue or item. Adding examples and clear rating conditions will also help for more accurate results. You can check out our guide on writing a good prompt, it's linked in the description below. Next, you need to select the detection and absent conditions. This lets the AI know how to score the category if the insight is detected, or whether to add the spotlight insight to the ticket or not. In my example, if the agent does verify the customer, the outcome is yes, and the AI will score the agent positively. And if the agent does not verify the customer, then the absence condition will be a no, and the AI will score them negatively. Finally, click to validate your prompt, and Zendesk QA will let you know if your insight would be best suited as a rating category or a spotlight insight, as well as if you need to make any changes to your prompt before creating. Remember, categories live in your scorecard and are automatically scored across your conversations, and these are best used for assessing agents' performance, whereas spotlight items live in the conversation panel and highlight specific events that occur within the conversation. These are best used for segmenting your tickets to find the most relevant to review. If creating a category, you can then add this to the scorecards of your choice, and AutoQA will score the category for you. If added as a spotlight item, the AI will now add the spotlight insight to each ticket it has been detected on. Now, it's important to keep in mind that AutoQA is not designed to replace your human reviewers, but instead to help your reviewers focus on the more critical areas while speeding up the time it takes to review, giving your team deeper insights and more time to focus on coaching your team. For example, now that AutoQA will auto-score your custom categories, you can easily filter out your tickets where agents have failed a particular one, meaning your reviewers can provide feedback to the agents who need it most. Likewise, your custom spotlight insights are also able to be filtered so you can do more targeted reviews on the interactions that are most critical to you. Additionally, your AutoQA dashboard will also track your custom categories, bringing you insights into how your team is doing across near 100% of your customer interactions. Now, when creating your custom prompts, it's important to know exactly what the AI is able to detect in a conversation. So keep these guidelines in mind. The AI can only read the content of the prompt, this means you cannot paste links into the prompt. For example, you could not link a Help Center article and expect the AI to be able to read it. Instead, you must input all the relevant details into the prompt itself. The AI is also only able to analyze the content of the ticket, meaning both agent and customer messages. So be sure what you are asking the AI to find and score can be found within the ticket content itself. Every account can have up to 10 active prompt-based AI insights at one time. And finally, at this stage, custom QA will not work on phone calls. This is being developed and will be available in a later update. Custom QA is now available in early access to all Zendesk QA and Zendesk Workforce Engagement Management customers. Reach out to your Zendesk representative to get it activated in your account.